Professor Neil Turok, founder of AIMS, Mr. Thierry Zamahon, president and the CEO of AIMS, Professor Francois Anglaire, Nobel laureate, faculty and the students of AIMS, Rwanda, Excellencies, uh, government officials, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. It's a pleasure. It's a great pleasure for me to join you today for the launch of the African Institute, Institute of Mathematical Sciences in Rwanda. We are honored to host the AIMS headquarters here in Kigali. AIMS is the latest addition to a STEM, to a system of science and technology related institutions based here in Rwanda. They all have a common purpose to provide opportunities for Africa's brightest minds to develop as problem solvers and innovators. There can be no more effective or better investment in Africa's future than in educating and empowering talented young people. We have to move beyond potential and create a workforce that will lead this real transformation for Africa. It will only be done through innovative scientific training, technical advances and breakthrough discoveries and that is not going to be a shortcut. For Africa to participate meaningfully in the global economy, we must build strong indigenous scientific and technological capacity. This is why we are pleased that AIMS is taking on this role. The capacity built right here on the African soil will reflect realities on the continent and better answer our challenges. Beyond training, research and public engagement, AIMS is also working to increase the number of math students through innovative teacher training techniques and putting mathematical scientists to work by partnering with industry. Together with AIMS, Rwanda is investing in the creation of a cohort of professionals and researchers who will make an impact on our country's development. To achieve this, we are collaborating to develop an ecosystem of Pan-African institutions with transformative agenda. As part of the ecosystem of transformation, 
the next Einstein Forum continues to catalyze action to translate these scientific advances into human benefit and to showcase the progress that Africa is making in science. In 2016, in March, the next Einstein Forum Global Gathering took place in Dakar, Senegal, where the majority of participants were young emerging scientists and technologists. I'm pleased that the second edition of the global gathering will take place in Kigali in March 2018. It will focus on establishing a clear roadmap for how Africa will transform by leveraging science, technology, and innovation. The digital revolution is transforming our world and creating multiple prospects for economic growth and societal progress. A new and important area of quantum information science and technology is merging and is bound to drive the next global cycle of innovation and industrial growth. We must be positioned to obtain maximum benefit from this new area of science. In this regard, Rwanda will work with the aims to establish Quantum Leap Africa, the first research center in quantum sciences in Africa. This will be a world-class center of scientific research and a leader in solving critical problems of development. The center will also build capability in the information technology of the future. We have always, we always move forward faster and achieve better results when we work together. Aims and other scientific centers of excellence here in Rwanda and across Africa are excellent examples of collaboration and partnership. We must fully support these institutions so that they are sustainable and productive. The African Union has endorsed aims and we all recognize that its ex educational model is an important tool for development and progress on our continent. In other words, let me come to conclusion by saying really that uh, to appreciate sciences in general, you do not have to be a scientist. Probably those of us who are not appreciate it even more. We are, because I think those who are take things for granted, but those who are not see the benefits firsthand. We are on the right path, and you can count on Rwanda as a committed partner. I wish to thank you for your very kind attention. <laughs>